Uh, your takeaway from Zach Wilson saying he needs to earn that starting job, perhaps a nod to and respect to James Morgan and Mike White, considering uh, his situation taking uh, number two overall. <laughs> Well, he said the same thing to me the day after the Jets drafted him when I interviewed him via Zoom. And I came away from that interview thinking he's really poised. Um, it didn't sound like re it was rehearsed or he thought he should use certain words to maybe impress someone. It was Zach, as you just saw him there, just sort of, you know, expressing himself and the idea that he does think he has to earn that starting quarterback job. And if you're Robert Sala, I think you absolutely love hearing that. Robert Sala, by the way, had a message for Zach Wilson. And it was, you know, we're going to lift you up. And Judy and Mark, I think that's really important in this town and in this climate where you can look at Zach Wilson and say the Jets have their savior. That's not going to work. What's going to work is Joe Douglas and Robert Sala building a competent team around Zach Wilson. And I thought that that was a nod to hearing his head coach. I thought Robert Sala had an outstanding weekend. And certainly Zach Wilson makes a very, very strong first or second impression. Well, Kim, and I think he made that impression on his new teammates as well. One thing that I was struck by that came out of the rookie camp was his new teammates saying, he's already taking charge, right? He was calling his teammates and saying, I'm so excited to have you on my team. He was talking about already organizing some workouts during the off season. One of his new teammates said, you know, he, his leadership skills are like a general, which may be a little premature at this point, <laughs> but you certainly like to hear that the brand new quarterback is already taking charge, is already drawing his teammates to him taking on a leadership role. Let's face it, it's a blank slate at the New York Jets. It's a new head coach. They are turning the page. This was a bad team. They've got a lot of young players. So you want to see the future franchise quarterback taking some sort of control and some sort of responsibility for how the offense is going to operate even just in these next few weeks.